Hey again everyone, Tekkenzo here and we're going to be going through rigging. So this will be practically the first exercise tutorial we've been doing, we'll be doing, well I'll be doing. I keep saying we, I'm the one doing all the tutorials here. So first of all you need to know your body parts. So most body parts, well we're going to be doing an arm, so we need the upper arm, the lower arm and the hand. So let's start making that. We're just going to do something simple, it won't look all realistic, but here we go. I'll start with a rectangle. You'll notice that I have mine is autofill. So when I draw my first part here, you know what, my lines are a bit thick, so I'll just change them a bit. Turn is fine. Awesome, great. So here we go. Nice and simple, skinny arm. Zoom it in, and I'll just call this upper arm. In this tutorial, we'll also be looking at the network also, so that will come in handy as well as using pegs. So this is our drawing. We're not done yet. Just need to add some circular-looking joints. So here we go. Shift Alt. And pull from the center, just something like this. I got that down. Cut across a bit so it's centered. Copy it and paste it. Then carry it up top. You know? Great. Something similar to this at least. Let's make this a little bigger, just a wee bit. Awesome. Same thing for you. So your first um, drawing will look something like this, but we don't want it to have the inner lines, so that's why we get rid of them using the cutter tool or you can use the contour tool. So just click on the line itself, press K to bring up the line, zoom in, press delete. Or I'll just use my contour editor. Do my contour. Click on the line. Delete it. And I'm pretty much free now. We do the same thing for the top. So we got this. Looks like a fudge stick somewhat. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to merge everything here. Flatten. So we'll do something like that. Right? Okay. Something like this. So we have one part. Let's just duplicate this layer so we can make a lower arm. See here, I'm duplicating my layer. And on this one, I'll just call this one lower arm. Got my lower arm. And I'm just going to carry it down a bit. My select tool. Let me lock the upper arm so I don't have to edit it when I'm using it. And I'll carry it down a bit. So about here is fine. Oops. Well, almost there. So 
so there is my lower arm so I have upper arm and lower arm need one more layer we'll create a hand just a simple little hand H-A-N-D so we're here at our wrist joint I guess just gonna draw a nice little circle and locking my lower arm and my upper arm just so I don't bother them and back to my head right I go to my drawing sheet so I can actually see it and I am going to use my rectangle tool draw a simple rectangle over it and of course get rid of my line here it's like nice one uni so now we need to make fingers so since this is a simple one what we're just gonna do is add some nodes so we can make some stuff we can change edit some nodes so for each finger I recommend that you use four nodes so you keep two down and two that can be risen up so here's my thumb one two three four then I need for my index finger one me zooming in I'll be zooming in man And one more. Each one of these four dots is probably just used for a gap. So here we go. I'm gonna highlight the center ones. Hold on shift so you can grab more than one. Time. And we grab these and we have that. So I'm just gonna use my arrow key, hold on shift, and carry up. And I got four fingers, I guess. You can always shift some stuff around if necessary. Like if that one's too long, you can just carry it over. Right, so we got our fingers here. And I got this one, so I can make it a little thicker. Now to get my thumb, grab this and carry it over. Right. So that's a thumb right there. If you want to add one more, you can. So I could get these two to come up like so. And I have a more interesting looking hand there. me but I guess you understand <laughs> well y'all know that thumb is a bit strong so here's my hand so camera view will look like this you see I have a hand there hand upper arm lower arm I could have just hand drawn this hand by myself, which sometimes I prefer to do. Like so. Just undo everything that I did a while ago. Just come here, contour editing. I guess that's a, a fair enough hand. So now you can check out every single layer now. Let me unlock these. So I've unlocked them. So when I click on each one, you'll see them highlight. That's my lower arm, that's my upper arm, and this is my hand. We got that covered. Don't really want the light table. So that's everything.
and you'll notice our network over here right never helps you to see everything in a hierarchy view anything attached to the composite will be seen as long as the composite is attached to display so we have all this well the problem is that we are seeing this arm and its lines we don't want the lines so in the next video i'm going to go through patching so hope you understand how to make your arm take care god bless and you know feel free to read first timothy it's a really good read take care